Hello everyone, I want to quickly let you know about a community discord that I've recently set up where you can join the conversation or ask any questions, for example, about your network that you have. You can post pictures in the chat here, talk directly to me, or get uh, any advice from any of the other players. And it's a great way to talk to me about current games I'm playing or any future games that you want me to play. So all you need to do is click the link in the description and it'll bring you right to my Discord server. For those of you who are wondering, I want to let you know that out of 24 hacks on my network that I've recorded, and 12 of those people couldn't get a single cap. So my defense is doing very well so far. And I want to focus on upgrading my Evolver like I talked about last episode because I really want to continue upgrading my shurikens and beam cannons my protector finished upgrading to level 14 i'm hoping to get it to level 15 at least i've heard that's a a solid level to get since i believe it can hold its own against the level 21 protector uh don't quote me on that though that's just what i think that they were saying anyways we have about we have 200,000 B coins that we need. We're only at 50,000, so we got a lot to do. So we found a little bit of a lucky break here. This guy has 62,000 B coins, which is quite a large amount considering what the usual um, amount people have is. So we'll, I want to quickly try and take out these first two code gates which shouldn't be a problem that's really the only thing I'm concerned about is getting the code gates there we go and now we're good to move on through here there we go now I just want to quickly get over to this black ice and then we can start taking down that other code gate. We're at two minutes now, so we're making good time. Just want to make sure I can get these down in appropriate time there. There we go. Okay, now we're moving on to the tough part. which I know I'm using a lot of protectors, but we should be fine once we get through that sentry there. Minute 30, I do have leeches if I need them. Should just take out that, ooh, almost. Here we go. Take out that black ice too, very nice. Now this one over here is the one with the storages. So that's the one that matters. There's all the B coins there. Put our leeches on it. Honestly, we could almost triple cap this guy, but I'm not gonna worry about it right now. We're just gonna grab all his B coins and run. There was a lot in there as well, perfect. There we go, 60,000 B coins to start us off. That's gonna put us over 100,000. So that's, now we're a lot closer. There we go, very nice. Camping on two and a half million dollars and 30,000 B coins. What a fine. Now this will be quite tough because his turrets are at a pretty high level there. And the rest looks pretty straightforward, but I want to play it as safe as possible because I don't want to let this opportunity of a huge loot, a fine to uh, pass us here. Good start, good start. Now we just gotta get through that other code gate. Oddly enough, he only has three. I think he's a 
pretty hard farmer since he is upgrading his other server farm there by his core. It's definitely what his focus is. Just want to get through this one here. Oh, whoops. Mess that up. Okay. Forgot about his hawk there. Threw me off. Now, I did have my protector upgraded. Let's see where my blaster's going towards the core. Which is fine. Let's just make sure we don't lose this one here. And then start heading towards his loot. Now that is a... I just want to play it safe here. quickly get over here, we're going to shocker that, and then we should be good here. The rest of this is just kind of getting cleaned up. And we have one more protector. A little bit sketchy there at the start because we actually lost that B-Coin mixer. Which I was really surprised since my protector is level 14 now, but I guess I really underestimated those the damage put out output of those turrets. I didn't expect it to be that high, but I suppose with the combination of the hawk, the antivirus, it does make sense. So we'll need to be careful of that next time. Do I need any leeches? Usually I make the mistake of not throwing them in quickly enough before I realize it's too late, but we will get the 2 million and 30,000 B coins. That is a huge haul. I don't think we'll be able to upgrade anything else since all my other building threads are busy. Although I would like to continue upgrading my beetle over here. We could upgrade it to level six. For four million that was a huge haul a very strong network here but I believe we can get through it with our shurikens that are a very high level he has some very strong choke points and his hawk is at a decent level there but we should be able to hold up here he is not at max core either we should be okay let's give this one a try it'll be fun he has a guardian choke point, which I do not often see. It's actually quite rare. Does he have a level 21 antivirus? Oh, way in the back. I suppose he doesn't need it if his nodes are such a, at such a high level there. Now that is a level one code gate, I believe. So that shouldn't be a huge deal to get through it. There we go. Oh, his hawk is right there. We need to try and keep that scanner alive so our protector can get up on it. Get our battering ramps going. We're gonna break through these code gates here and then put down our shurikens to get through those code gates and onto his loot. That is the plan. It should work just fine. Once these uh, battering rams are done, I'll use one more shocker just to help out the shield on that protector there, even though it looked like it was doing just fine. I just want to make sure to be, to be safe, we'll use it again there. 
Our beam cannon should be able to rip through these. Ooh. Those gold storages. Taking a little bit more of a hit there. And there's probably some... Oh, oh, I see. I was like, why? Why is that not getting taken back? There's no antivirus there. We were so fast. It didn't even stand a chance. Could we actually triple cap this guy? Let's give it a try here. Well, I guess I didn't really need to do that. I didn't notice this. It was just one more uh, beetle connected to that. Whoops. Rip those B coins. Just taking out this last node and that'll be a triple cap and a lot more money and B coins for us to take back. And I believe we are now at 150,000, probably at 140 once I get my programs back up and running, but this is going a lot faster than I expected. Next one up here, we got a Melstorm defense network that our shurikens should work very well against. And our goal, remember, is just getting those B coins. 45,000 available. I think we can do it. And there's three code gates at the start there. Nah, I'm kind of surprised they don't have more. But that's fine with me. Let's get through these and then start taking his core. And it looks like the only AI they have is the beetle there. No hawk or anything. So a lot of farm farming nodes. I think we can take this one. Gotta be careful though, because they do have a high level sentry. And this turret will bring us straight to his B coins. And our protectors won't have any issue holding up there. Very nice. Where is... Oh, it doesn't look like he has an... Oh, uh, there's... Yeah, it'll be all in his storages here. So we'll quickly grab this, and then we'll be on our way. We have another one here. I guess we can uh, see how much we can grab of his other nodes. Antivirus hits for a lot, so if we're gonna do this, we gotta be careful. And just a little more cleaning up here. Not sure what's taking that, all that black ice there. Got that, got that, and that turret there. Snag that. I think that's everything. I suppose we can triple cap him. That worked out really well. Not as many uh, defenses. Uh, he had a lot of server farms and Bitcoin mines, so it was a little bit, a little bit easier there to get our full control of his and the triple cap plus nine. Not bad. That puts us at 180,000. So we got one more to do here. And then we can conti continue to upgrade our Evolver. But it would be really nice if we could spend our money if we had another building thread. Wait. It caught. I have 2,700 credits. Can. Did someone gift these? There's, no, there's no gifting. Okay, okay. You know, we got 2,700 credits all of a sudden. 
All right, I'll take it. Uh, there we go. All right, cool. So, all right, now we can uh, <laughs> we could start upgrading our our little beetle guy. There you go. And we could spend that money. Now that that's done, we can um, get the rest of the beat coins we need here. Ooh, okay. From dust till dawn. 39,000 beat coins. Looks like they're all going to be in his beat coin mixers there. Quite a high level network for sure. Level 60. I'm level 55, I think. If I remember correctly. Okay, I gotta wait for that squid. Oh no, I don't think I'm gonna get his other code gate. Rip. I'll try, I'll try, I'll try, I'll try it. Come on, come on, come on. Yes, we got it. No way. We got his second code gate there. That was clutch. I thought for sure we weren't gonna get it. That saves us a ton of time there. That was huge. On this high level network, that's really nice. Hasn't even gotten to his scanner yet. And his antivirus, oh, his antivirus isn't gonna get to the rest of his network because, oh, what am I doing? Because of that code gates upgrading. This is gonna be easy. Okay, remember that for, for that first hack, those turrets destroyed my protector. So I'm gonna be careful there. Just throw in the extra protection and just play it safe. I mean, really, there's nothing else to worry about now. Um, I suppose we can go for the the triple cap here. Why not? Let's do it. We're getting it done. The triple cap. Oh gosh, that's hitting for a lot. There we go. The ones on the outside. We are getting it done this episode. Yo, these hacks have been huge. The hulls have been massive. We're getting a ton of reputation as well. If you didn't see, I'm actually over 1,100 reputation, so I'm really starting to get up there now. We got all his B-Coins, just gonna wait for his money to roll in, and we will be good to go. Boom, 39,000. Admin, hey, Malaka, Nas, Proficita. Oh, okay. Cool, um, I think they're from Malaysia. Anyways, we got the 200,000 B coins. We, oh gosh, I was gonna say maybe we could upgrade our protector, but that is 260,000. I have to upgrade my storages if I wanna get that to level 15, yikes. That is a lot. Okay, anyways, let's focus on getting this done. Four days. That is one and a half days away. Man, we got a lot going on right now. So that will be all for this episode. I hope you all enjoyed these huge hacks we've been getting. Almost 1,200 reputation. Leave a like if you all enjoyed. And I will see you all next time.